Hey everyone, welcome back. I'm Caesar from Pointy Hills Hyundai, and today I'm going to be going over the screen theme for the Ionic 5. All right, so something that's newer for these Hyundai systems, especially with the Ionic 5, is going to be a screen theme slash layout. So if we tap here, you're going to be able to kind of change this like your phone nowadays. You have a dark mode and then like a day mode. So if you like this white background, you can do it here. You can do the black. That'll be a lot darker. Now, once you just change that, I'm not sure if you can see, but it also change the cluster to the black as well. Or you can schedule the time. So if you want, you know, the okay, so displays a black theme during the time set. So if you want it to go on right when the sun goes down, you know, just depending on what time that is for you, you can do it like that until what time the sun rises or whatever other time you want to stay uh, on black. Now, you can go to screensaver. Now, these ones, you're going to be able to only allow these uh, when you turn the display off, meaning if I tap this button, when this displays off, it's going to show either this digital clock or you have an analog clock, but I believe that they have different styles. Yes, they do. So you should have eight styles of which analog clock that you may want to see. And this one's pretty nice. So let's go here, display off. Now, if you are listening to the radio, um, you do have the nav system going. All that uh, stuff will still be if you have the voice on for the Navi, um, it'll still tell you when you need to turn. Um, the radio will still be able to play, but you're just mainly minimizing all the other icons from here and you're just having this display. Now, if we go to split screen, so split screen we will get into and I will show you example right when I go over all these little icons. So some of them are uh, shadowed, that means they're automatic, but you have electric vehicle, weather, calendar, compass, and clock. So let's just keep all that on. And what I mean is, let's just go back to the maps really quick. You do have on this corner, this side, um, you have a little arrow. So what you can do is you can actually tap that and it'll pop open. So you have your CarPlay or your music, whatever it was connected. And you can go up or down, doesn't matter. So if you go up, it'll show more of the nav, okay? It'll show the energy information, so how much range, battery, and nearby stations. And of course, you can search the stations. Then you have your clock again. You have your compass. You have your calendar, so if it's permitted. And then your weather, not available at the moment. And then back to the car play. So if we go back to the settings, to screen and theme layout, split screen, you can check mark some of these if you don't want them. So let's say that wasn't active right now. Calendar is not active, clock, compass. It'll only show these four electric, map, radio, and the clock for you. And that's what the split screen does. Thank you for joining us again. Hopefully, you enjoyed our video on the screen theme for the Ionic 5. If you have any questions, go ahead and leave them in the comments box. And like always, like, share, subscribe, and we'll see you next time here at Pointy Hills Sunday.